you said the state's not offering. We don't know that they are or they aren't, but at this point, it doesn't look like it. What if he went to the state? Would they, could they ultimately look at this and say, this is an expensive process for these people? And this is Idaho. We don't have a huge taxpayer base. Could they change their minds, even though they have a slam dunk and accept a plea? Yes, they can. And the defense team needs to look into that. Look, we all do what's called damage control. We look at a case, assess the, the risk and the benefit analysis and decide what to do. And Chad Daybell has got to be looking at this and saying the best that the, the Lori's defense team put on she got convicted of everything. He's got that and then some. If he truly wants to live out his days without getting executed, then they could be reaching out to the state to say, we're done. We'll take the life sentence uh, and move on. Save a lot of money for Idaho, save a lot of time, a lot of trouble, and just move the case forward. And we as defense attorneys have to look at those